Left, four GPUs run void theory at 0.8 milliseconds per step. Right, quantum platform takes 32 seconds, burning 25 kilowatts. At its core, 128 cube grid, 1,000 time steps. HBM3 hits 3 terabytes per second. FP16 errors under 0.1%. Tensor engine design, built for analog physics. Tearing mode at 2.14 seconds. Experimental, 2.17 plus or minus 0.03. Void tracks Q greater than 1.5 collapse. Kernel, curvature step, 17 teraflops, 98% SM use. PTX shows vector ops, not brute force, but analog sim. Void needs just 8 joules per plasma step. Quantum hardware uses 250. Traditional solvers use 120. Curvature evolves in 4D CFL under 0.3C. Growth, 0.2, 2 per microsecond, within 12% of fusion data. GPU thermal profile, steady at 42 degrees Celsius with liquid cooling. Over 18,000 compute cores, 900 gigabytes per second interconnect. No dilution fridge, no noise, just raw analog compute. Quantum system needs 10,000 runs, 200 seconds total, due to decoherence. Void simulation runs FP32 deterministically, with bit error below 1 in a trillion. Inside a live fusion control room, void system forecast disruption with 92% confidence. Q profile hits 2.01, instability imminent. This is real-time plasma control, powered by void.